assalamu alaikum welcome to my channel linguistics and literature today's our lecture is about semantic theories as the word semantic shows related to meaning during communication we lose our communication because we do not pay attention how we communicated our our listener recognized us so many scholars worked on it spent countless years in formula formulating theories regards methods of effective communication and they formulated many theories so today we will study theories of meaning by ogden and richard i prepared very precise notes and tried to make them visible these are very effective for semantic students now let's see the theories by ogden and richard Ogden and Richards Richards worked on approaches by human they faced during communication and they their communication they wrote a book the meaning of the meaning which is about what is meant by meaning they wrote about the errors of mental processes when word create confusion when our communication diminish and the words makes misunderstandings and ways to avoid these misunderstandings they gave the semantic triangle this triangle defines the relation between symbol image and thoughts in our mind this triangle shows at one corner symbol the object or refer and at the other corner is object or referent and at the third corner we we take thought thoughts about the object in our mind we will try to understand relations by an example let's take example of cat at one corner we will take symbol cat the graphical representation of cat at the other corner we will take image of the cat the object and at third corner we will take our thoughts the color color legs features sound etc as the relation between symbol the cat and thoughts in our mind the thoughts about cat the color features everything the sound of the cat is direct relationship and the relation between thoughts and image is also direct relation but relation between symbol and image is indirect relation it is arbitrary relation as the word cat the graphical representation of cat and the image of cat has no natural relation there is no one to one correspondence between c a t cat word and the image of the cat the word cat does not shows the features of cat so the relation between symbol and image is arbitrary richards and ogden gave proper meaning superstition theory proper meaning superstition th theories says that words does not have meaning but meanings are interpreted by people meanings depends upon background knowledge past experience of listener and the experience of speaker they defined this theory as each word is not associated with a single correct meaning but each word have different meaning for different person or the meaning does not reside in word it reside in humans let's take an example consider a word glass the meanings of glass varies from person to person if someone asks what is meant by glass one will take it as mirror the other will take it as water glass so the meaning of glass is different for people by situation let's take another example if one who likes pets listens a word dog he or she will like word dog and if a person a person who does not like pet will take it in bad sense will take dog in bad sense Richards and Ogden used metaphor to define meaning. Metaphor helps in creation of meaning by making a link between words and ideas by humans or experiences which he or she and the audience shared. Let's take an example. If one does not know about a person's courage or daringness, 
we will not express sorry we will try to express his bravery by making link with a brave creation like lion and we will say he is a lion richard and ogden also gave theories uh, the definition theory and sample theory and we will continue them in next video okay please like and subscribe my channel